are here at Eagle County BMX, and I am doing a riding school for the local riders here in town. So what's a couple things you want to learn over the next couple days? I've been to some surrounding areas. I've been down to the BMX track in Carbondale. I've been to some tracks in Denver uh, throughout the years, but first time in Eagle. I love Colorado. I'm from Las Vegas. There's no green. It's just desert. Where do you guys think you should put your pedal? I like to split my classes up. I have the beginner group and the more advanced group, and I went to a bunch of clinics when I was a kid. I remember the ones that I liked, I remember the ones I didn't like, and I always try to give back in a positive way. And my goal is that all these riders leave here today and they learned at least one new thing. One thing you learned. Nice. That's an important one. But ultimately that they had fun. They enjoyed riding their bike and spending time out to get my track. It's good for the local track, every local track. It serves it well to bring in different people to come and teach. Uh, Every rider is going to pick something new up that they might not have learned before. And on top of that, they might have been waiting for this for a month, excited about it. It's always a, a fun experience to be able to bring that, bring something special to the local track here. I try to just leave a positive impact for the sport that I love and that's given me so much. Good work. Good drink. My family and I, we, when I was growing up, we used to volunteer. My dad would score at the finish line, reading the number plates and seeing who got what place. And you know, I would be out there early water in the track and doing things like that. So it's totally volunteer run, but that's part of what makes the sport so fun is everybody's out here for one reason and one reason only. That's because they love it.